Hey guys, I'm going to show you how to fix this problem on Windows 11 operating system. In the first step, go to search bar and type in Windows Firewall and then click on Windows Defender Firewall. On this window, we need to click on Turn Windows Defender Firewall on or off. Then check this box, turn off Windows Defender Firewall, again scroll down and from public network settings, again select this one. After that click on OK, once done, close this window, then simply right click on start icon, then select run and simply type here REG edit and click on OK. Now on this window we need to just expand hkey classes root, just expand it, then we need to find out dot exe. So here it is. Simply select it and on the right side right click on default select modify and make sure the spell of exe file and it Should be correct after that click on ok again find out simply exe file On the same hk classes root just just scroll down and make sure simply click on exe file then right click on default on the right side select modify and make sure in the value data this should be double quote percent one double quote percent star so type this and click on ok after that expand exe file then expand shell folder and select open again on the right side right click on default select modify and the same value data should be here double quote percent one double quote percent star this one after that we need to click on ok and close this one then simply right click here select task manager then go to random task select browse button go to this PC open C folder and then open Windows folder then find out C systems 32 folder just double click on it to open it then find out cmd.exe file so here it is select it and click on open now check this box and click on ok once we are here we need to execute some commands so firstly type in gp update and hit enter so this will take some time to complete the you know process we need to wait for some time around four to five seconds once done we need to type in assoc space dot exe equal to exe file and hit enter once done type exit to close the command prompt window and simply restart your system your problem will be solved and you're good to go